Hey Guitar Ninjas and welcome to another instalment of the Guitar Ninja Students Are Awesome. Again, you've probably seen some videos of me online playing guitar. I share them around quite a lot to make sure that when you think of guitar, you think of me and the Guitar Ninja. But obviously, it's not just about me, it's about the students and the progress they make. So in this session, we're going to have a look at some of the students that have passed their Ninja grades and how quickly and inspirational some of the students have been in doing so. So if you don't already know, here are the Guitar Ninja grades. We grade through coloured straps, just like martial artists grade through the coloured belts. Hence the reason I mentioned some of the martial art things in the things that have done away from guitar. So we've got the coloured straps that they progress through. So from your first lesson, you can start to get close towards the white strap pretty much in one session. It's designed there to help you feel like you've made some progress and help you understand that you can learn. Then as we progress through until you get your black strap, and the black strap means that you've got a good, strong foundation of all areas of music ready to specialise. It doesn't mean, I've got my black strap, I'm all done, end of the day. Woo! No. The black strap is all about the fact that you've reached enough of a foundation to choose where you want to specialise in guitar. So if you want to become an original artist, a session musician, just have fun in the bedroom, specialise on theory, perhaps even become a teacher of your own, that's where the journey then starts for the more specialist areas. So this is about getting a good foundation. So with each strap, you're going to get the strap, plectrum, badge and a certificate to pass through your grades. So today we're going to have a look at all the students that have worked really hard to get their gradings because for these we've got to learn songs, we've got to play in time. Now the songs aren't specific, I've purposely left it so there's a criteria of rules for you to hit but you can pick a song that fits your style. So if you're a metal fan, you can play metal. But if you're a pop fan, you're not going to be forced to play metal. You can play a pop song as long as it fits the requirements. So it's all down to you. So there have been lots of students that have passed through their white strap. We've had students that have gone up through yellow, orange, green, and so far, we still don't have a black strap student yet. We have one brown, and at the beginning of lockdown, we only had one purple strap, but now we've got five. So I'm just going to put up some pictures now. I'm going to try and make them nice and quick. So I'm going to put up the video now of all the photos of them passing through their grades so that you can see how well they're done. Now some of the students would have skipped over a couple of grades. If you've been playing for a little while, then your first grade and you're welcome to do a couple of skips as long as you grade through them. So some of them went straight to orange or green without getting the previous grades, but they graded through them in that one grading to make sure that they didn't skip any knowledge. So here is a quick showreel of them all to celebrate the students that have passed their strips. Well, thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed that. If you want to pass your grades yourself, then have a look in the description. Have a look at the links they'll send you through where you can find the information on how to grade if you already want to, how to get lessons, or how to learn other ways through the Guitar Ninja to pass your straps. If you're interested in more, then feel free to leave anything you want in the comments below. Please hit that thumbs up and subscribe if you haven't already, and I'll catch you in the next video soon. Bye!